Well, it's uh, Saturday the 4th out here. Nice, uh, bright, sunny day. And I'm uh, working on this little engine business here. And uh, today I installed a pressure gauge. And we're good and warmed up right now. Some carb adjustments and or overhaul are probably in order. But I got a decent, decent idle going on. Um, as far as the speed goes, and uh, it's good and warm. And uh, if we can see, I'm holding, uh, you know, a respectable, uh, nearly 20 pounds at an idle. Anyway, I'm going to call the oil pressure all right, and uh, i got to do a little compression business and see how that works out, but uh, I'm thinking the bottom end of this will hold together for a while, so, yeah. Saturday afternoon now, and having decided to use the uh, engine over there on the stand, um, yeah, I went ahead and pulled uh, the old double cab out so I can attack this mess. Um, clean up all my tools and crap laying around, but um, I want to uh, wash this engine down. So what I think I'm going to do real quick is strip it and uh, roll it outside, strip it down to a long block, plug the intake holes, leave the plugs in it, cover up the carb, and take it outside and give it a blast. So I think that's what I'll do. And then while it's, you know, drying out and whatever, I can go ahead and Clean up the mess. Well, I pretty well got this uh, engine stripped so it can get cleaned up, but uh, I noticed that there was a great big nut on this guy. This stud here is actually loose in the head, and it's the wrong size. This has been repaired, drilled, and tapped. Um, so I'll have to uh, sort out a better nut to put on there. It works a little better. Maybe Loctite this guy in the head so it doesn't come out. I don't know. We'll see. But I had an exhaust leak here, so I decided I better take the uh, uh, the header off of here and uh, deal with that and don't you know it I hate it when that happens but uh, in fact it happened and um, so I'm gonna have to deal with that tomorrow but um, other than that it wasn't too bad um, we did have another occurrence of the same uh, right here this little guy that holds the tin on same business snap that turkey off but uh, yeah, so I'm about ready to clean this thing. Do that tomorrow. Um, kind of wanted to show this little thing what I do here to plug the uh, ports when I'm washing them down or just in storage for a long time is uh, these little guys. And what that is is like a little, I don't know, I guess a golf ball drive it in your house thing. It's foam. But it's like a little uh, practice golf uh, ball and they're foam come in a little package but um, they squeeze right down in the uh, ports of these things and expand and seal it up watertight and it's a good way to keep dirt out better than uh, trying to clean everything up without dropping crap in and putting uh, duct tape or whatever works real well and good for storage or uh, hosing them down pressure washing whatever you're gonna do so that's what I got pretty balls Anyway, had enough for today, so uh, thanks for watching.